The Brain That Changes Itself is a groundbreaking book by Dr. Norman Doidge that explores the science of neuroplasticity, the ability of the brain to change and adapt in response to new experiences. The book is a fascinating journey through the latest research in the field of neuroplasticity and how it can be used to overcome a variety of neurological conditions, including brain injury, stroke, chronic pain, and learning disorders. The book begins by introducing the reader to the traditional view of the brain as a fixed and unchanging organ. Dr. Deutsch explains how, for centuries, scientists believed that the brain's structure and function were determined at birth and could not be changed. However, over the past few decades, research has revealed that the brain is far more adaptable than previously thought. The book then delves into the many examples of neuroplasticity in action, including stories of people who have overcome brain injuries and disorders through neuroplasticity-based therapies. The book also explores the use of neuroplasticity to enhance cognitive function, improve learning and memory, and even increase intelligence. One of the most compelling aspects of the book is the way it presents the latest scientific research in an accessible and engaging way. The book is filled with real-life stories of people who have overcome neurological conditions through neuroplasticity-based therapies, and these stories serve to illustrate the incredible potential of the brain to change and adapt. The book also addresses the ethical and societal implications of neuroplasticity. The potential of neuroplasticity-based therapies to overcome neurological conditions is clear but the book also raises important questions about the implications of these therapies for society. Dr. Deutsch also explores the potential of neuroplasticity to enhance cognitive function and improve learning and memory, and the ethical implications of these applications of these applications. He also examines the implications of neuroplasticity for education and the workplace, and how society can best take advantage of this new understanding of the brain to improve human well-being. In conclusion, The Brain That Changes Itself is a thought-provoking and engaging book that provides a comprehensive overview of the latest research on neuroplasticity. The book is filled with real-life stories of people who have overcome neurological conditions through neuroplasticity-based therapies, and these stories serve to illustrate the incredible potential of the brain to change and adapt. The book also addresses the ethical and societal implications of neuroplasticity and how society can best take advantage of this new understanding of the brain to improve human well-being. It is a must. Read for anyone interested in the brain, neuroscience, and the latest research in the field of neuroplasticity.